what we're going to do is just a really cool, fun little, you know, face framing, very cool, modern kind of shaggy look, which uh, I think is very appealing to her. We're going to start off in the back, and we're going to cut basically a one length line, you know, but with just a little graduation, we're going to break into the line. So we're going to start just by sectioning her hair off, and then we'll get to the back, and I'll show you what we're going to do. Make sure you comb the hair smooth, clean from the scalp all the way through to the ends. Now when we do the sides, we're just going to bring the sides all back, leave a little bit more length because over direction, that's what we're going to be doing, gives us length and gives us weight. Combing from the underneath, using the large teeth of the comb now, so I get very little tension. Bring this back and we're just going to cut a nice square line just like that. This is forward graduation or face framing layers. So we're just going to take sections now and we're going to over direct everything forward like this. And graduation, of course, is 0 to 89. So this would be 90. So what we're going to do is we're just going to hold this slightly below. And there's our first section. The trick is to see if we can do the same thing on the opposite side. We've got the sides cut, and sometimes I like to cut those before I do the actual front. So let's start on that fringe area and the top. Okay, let's do the other side now. As we pull this forward, we're just increasing the elevation just ever so much. And I love the moving around the front. It's commercial, but it's commercial with a bit of an edge, which I really like. Anytime that you have a one length hair, and you have either graduation or layers, you end up with somewhat of a corner. We're just gonna go in and take that corner off. Even if it just dried naturally with a little product, it would be fabulous. Lots of layers, lots of, you know, fun textures throughout and loads of products. Now, we're gonna flat iron and show you a totally different look. Remember, never lock yourself in a box. Think about the possibilities that you have with finishing. Teach your clients a little bit more. Do a little bit more than you have to. Clients will love that.